Okay. We learned fractions earlier on, right? Yeah. And we said fractions are fractions are uh, equal. Uh, Alright. So we have something like this. Master and teacher has eaten my apple twice in class six. A very funny way of writing mathematics I learned when I was in I was a little child. So mathematics. And then I said fractions. So fractions are what equal parts of a whole. Hmm? If you should have something like this, have something like this, and then we take it out. What fraction have we taken out? One out of two. One out of two. Okay. However, we don't always we don't always get we don't always get things in this form. Or let's let's see another fraction, maybe something like this, into four parts, and we take one. What's this fraction I've shaded? One out of four. Okay. We don't always get things in whole. Neither do we always get things at in fractions. There are days you could go to, let's say, uh, a party, and then you took all the parts, or you went to the uh, 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 food joint, and then you ate everything. Let's say you took everything. In this case, what's the fraction going to be? What's the fraction say that four out of four? You got a four out of what? Out of four. And then you came to your, let's say you moved to the next table to join the pits. And they gave you one out of four. In all, how many have you taken? Five out of four. Okay, Roy. Anybody, the answer can be right. Don't. Five whole number. Okay, let's. I, I want. To, I want to listen and, and talk. You get what? Okay, he is saying that you get one whole. You get so comparing this and this. So four out of four is isn't it? four out of four be called one? Remember whole fractions. Yeah. Oh, what are whole fractions? Yeah. Listen and talk. Okay, and now. All right, so numerator and that's a whole fraction. And they are also they are always equal to whole fractions are equal to they are also equal to mm, mm, they are always equal to oh, they are equal to one out of one whole number. They are equal to a whole or they are equal to which number? One. one. So four out of four is the same as one. Agreed. Do you all agree? So four out of four is the same as one. So if I have this, I can therefore say I have, looking at this, I can say, comparing this to, I can freely say, pay attention, I can say I have one whole number and then one out of four. Agreed? Yes. Agreed? Yes. Right. So I have one whole number, one out of four. Or I can, I can also say, I can also call it an improper fraction where I have how many total parts do I have? Total parts. One, this is one out of four, right? Are you following? Another one out of four. 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 Right? So let's let's follow carefully. So I have so let's let's do let's do the addition. So I have one over four plus. 1 over 4 plus uh -huh. 1 over 4 plus 1 over 4 1 over 4 Are we following? Yes. So when I add this, how many do I have? 5 over 4 5 out of 4 Remember when we are doing additions, we don't add a denominator So I would have what? Yeah, we never change So 5 out of 4 So we can simply say one out of four is equal to, sorry, one whole number, one out of four is equal to five out of four. 
Is that okay? Yes. So this whole what this whole thing here is what we call mixed. Mixed what? Fractions. Mixed fractions. So mixed fractions are fractions with a number, a whole number and a fraction. Are you following? Yeah. A whole number and a fraction gives you a mixed fraction. And what, what what's the name of this kind of fraction? In our earlier class, Joe. This is an improper fraction, correct? So improper. So improper fractions. So can we can we say that can we say that mixed fractions are another way of writing improper fractions? Can we say that? Will it be true when I say mixed fractions are another way of writing improper fractions? Yes. This is a mixed fraction. And it's an improper fraction. Yes. Five out of four is the same as one number one over four. Yes. Right?